to find the union of two sets. So union, right, means to kind of combine, bring together. So remember that the union, uh, let's call this set A and let's call this set B. So A, union B, means that all elements X, X represents all the members or the elements, such that X is contained in the A or X is contained in the B. Now remember, or is going to be inclusive. That means it can be in A, it can be in B, or it can be in both of them. So we need to look at this. Look at which members or elements are contained in either one of these or both of them. So we notice that there's no members that they share. They all, actually they both share nine, right? So even since nine is in both of them, it is included. I do not need to write it twice. So A, union B, the union of my two sets A and B is going to be, I'm just gonna order them from least to greatest, two, three, four, six, eight, nine. Now I don't need to write nine twice um, because it's just saying listing the elements, okay? So we're just listing what elements are in either one of them or both. So I don't need to write nine twice and 12. Okay, so that is going to be the union of those two sets. What you noticed is when I did the union of those two sets, I pretty much just took all the elements of A, took all the elements of B, and brought them in together. And that's how you find the union of two sets.